I found a guitar that was owned by Mr. Paul Reed Smith himself. Yeah, this guy. So I better show you how it sounds. Let's get started. Hey guitarists, welcome back to Squeal and Pig Guitars, the home of luxury instruments here in Nottingham, England. Today we have a Modern Eagle 1 PRS guitar that was owned and signed by the OG builder himself, Mr. Paul Reed Smith. Paul is known for his keen eye for perfection, and this is actually a P guitar, um, as you can see by the small little um, stamped in P on the back of the headstock. So that means that this guitar was made exclusively for Paul in his spec. As you can see, it's basically a Modern Eagle uh, guitar, which is um, a very high-end private stock made guitar. It was actually the first model made by the private stock. So as far as specs go, it's essentially a standard Modern Eagle one with a faded blue jean finish. This is actually a nitro finish on this one, which is beautiful. Uh, but basically, the only thing that's different is that the pickup's been changed um, to suit Paul's taste. And you can see they have this uh, lovely zebra bobbin, which I really like. Usually you see chrome covers on this model, um, so I like that change. Up to present day, we've had five versions of the Modern Eagle series of guitars, and this is the first one, so that already makes it more rare and uh, more desirable. These guitars were made between 2004 and 2007. And basically, the purpose of the Modern Eagle series was to showcase the new innovations in guitar technology that PRS had delivered. So basically, each year you're going to have, or each uh, version of the guitar, you're going to have the most up-to-date specs that you can get. I know on the most recent one you have a very complicated switching system with different coil splitting and stuff like that. The PRS Modern Eagle is a guitar with a satin nitrocellulose finish, a Brazilian rosewood wide fat neck. The Modern Eagle alongside the Makati that PRS make is actually thicker in body size than the Custom Series, so it feels a little bit more Gibson-y. And um, personally, I think it creates a little bit of a better tone, a little bit more of a well-rounded tone. The Modern Eagle logo on the headstock is different than the usual PRS signature. And other features are, it has 22 frets, it has abalone bird inlays, Brazilian rosewood headstock veneer, PRS phase two locking tuners with gold buttons. We also have a PRS stop tail bridge, um, which is really nice. It's like a wraparound bridge and stays in tune really well. Also creates lots of sustain. We have a 10 inch fretboard radius on this and the scale length is 25 inches, so a little bit longer than a Gibson. We have 22 frets and the fret size are medium. And um, as I said previously, we have the abalone uh, inlays on this one. In terms of the playability, this guitar really does sing. I've always preferred the Modern Eagle and McCarty designs to the standard custom series. I think this is down to the fact that these guitars have a thicker body and a fatter neck, which makes it feel more Gibson-y, and I believe contributes to a more well-rounded tone with more bass end and lower mids, which I personally prefer in a guitar. The neck on this Modern Eagle is absolutely perfect. I love the fact that it's a one piece of Brazilian rose, but it's really dark and streaky in person. Um, just make sure to keep oiling it if you do um, own this guitar, as they can dry out quite easily. As this is a Modern Eagle guitar, you get the cool Modern Eagle one case uh, with a plaque on the side. These cases wear an absolute ton, but they're so cool to look at. You have like a kind of suede and a camel-like outside skin with gold latches and then the inside, you, as you can see here, you have red plush with the private stock logo on it. It's a really nice piece uh, for this guitar and um, yeah, awesome guitars. In terms of personal experience with Modern Eagles, I used to own a Modern Eagle Quattro, which was the fourth um, version of this guitar. And this was essentially like this guitar, but it had a tremolo and it had a high gloss finish. Um, but the Modern Eagle guitars are, in my opinion, the best stuff that PRS make. Just like any other PRS, this guitar is set up incredibly well and holds this nation uh, perfectly. Um, I didn't find any dead spots on this guitar, the frets are in great working order, and for a guitar um, that's nearly 20 years old, it has barely a nick on it, it's a beautiful condition. And the coil splits are very convincing, like most PRS guitars, I actually prefer the coil split sound to the humbucker tones. So 
So if you have any questions about this guitar, then feel free to leave a comment down below or send us an email on Screen and Pick Guitars. Um, but yeah, let's hear some more tones from this beast. Thank you so much for watching today's video guys make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment if you have any thoughts that you'd like to share uh, but i will see you in the next episode of squealing pig guitars see you soon